Tan 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 tan. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is a presentation of Extreme TV for the Toy Ranter, and this is a review, another award-winning review, and with your host from Cobra, Baroness. Hello, kitties. Welcome back to another Toy Rant review for Extreme TV. Hail Cobra. And today, we are going to have a good old review of... Bam! Cobra Crimson God. Yes. We had a review of that bitch, I mean, Zarana and G.I. Joe Dusty. Now, it is the final three. I hope you look at the other reviews. <laughs> and check out the G.I. Joe <laughs> edition, first edition review. <laughs> and once again, thanks to all the subscribers for the 1K views. Thank you. Our first. All right. So, like I said, we reviewed Zaytana. Sorry, another franchise, Zarana and Dusty. Now, we review the Crimson Guide, Cobra. Yes, gang. All right, let's get started. And once again, I want to thank everybody for um, all the views on the um, G.I. Joe um, uh, rant. I did a couple of, of months ago. Thank you for the 1K. I want to thank all my subscribers. And leave your comments below. Tell me what y'all think about the recent G.I. Joe live stream. Um, I was kind of impressed. Um, ton of rat. I don't know too much about Big Boa. But I am definitely going to get Scrap Iron. Um, I'm definitely going to get that new Firefly. Um, I don't know about Snow Job. I'll probably not won't get him and i'm definitely going to get a uh, copperhead and rock and roll nah but i'm definitely going to get quick kick about time and um shipwreck is one of my favorites so i'm not getting that uh falcon because the face is just horrible hasbro sometimes you, you take two steps forward and takes five thousand steps back but anyway was impressed. I was impressed. I can't even, I'm not even going to lie to y'all. I was very impressed with the uh, characters, uh, the chosen ones. The uh, Tunnel Rat and, 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 and uh, the Wetsuit. Wetsuit is definitely going to get getting and low light. Wow. Hopefully they'll make a cesspool since they made uh, Scrap Iron. All right, let's get the review underway. This is the Crimson Guard. On the side here, you got art, side art, okay? Very nice, very regal. And on the other side, it's the, focus on that, Crimson Guard. You got the, it's number 50 in the collection. Nothing on top, 50. And this is very, 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 very hard to find. I'm, I mean, wow. Maybe on Hasbro Pulse. What you talk? What you think about Hasbro Pulse, man? They uh, they are uh, having a warehouse sale. So, and guess what? This guy isn't a part of the sale. <laughs> yeah. So, all right, let's pop this guy open and um, get this review going. We're going to review GI Joe Classified. Very rare. Very hard to get in retail. Crimson Guard. Yes, so, all right. So I know other people have reviewed this guy, but they are not extreme. And they don't uh, represent the secret society of underground extreme toy collectors. They're not us. They're not, they're not me. They're not fucking extreme. They're lame and they're garbage. All right, number 15 in line. Let's, cause I like keep the box. Cut the little tape right there. Put 
to the side, open up from the top. And we're gonna slide this guy out. I wanna thank everybody for making this channel so extreme. All right, inside the box is the Cobra logo that we know and love from way back in the 80s. Crimson Guard, okay. Put that to the side. And here it is, all regal in a plastic prison. All right, what he comes with, he comes with the, the backpack, the Cobra logo on. You can see that, yeah. And he comes with the sword holder, the sword, knife, this gun with the knife in it, gun and clip, wow. All right, let's get this guy out in the clam shell, right? Right here on the screen. Oh my God. They also supposed to be coming out, coming out with this guy on a, um, a retro card, Walmart exclusive. All right, we're gonna put this figure to the side. We're gonna look at the accessories. Okay, we're gonna look at the accessories. All right, and we're gonna pose them. We're gonna do all kinds of stuff. All right, let's get this out. Get the backpack. All right. Very nice. It's all in black. Uh, some people say, why can't they just um, put color to this? But it's nice. Nice molding. Little backpack. Little peg on the side so he can put his gun, I guess. We'll see. Okay, let's put that. Next, we're going to take out the gun hilt. I mean, the sword hilt. I'm so sorry. All right. It's a little slot there. I don't know if you can see that. Very nice. This is, you got, you got, I mean, there's one thing about G.I. Joe classified. They uh, got a lot of nice accessories. So uh, leave that, you leave your comment below. Tell me what y'all think about the live stream and all the, uh, there's a sword. <laughs> what y'all think about the price points? Gun. Talk about that knife. We're going to put everything back. Oh, yeah. Cobra, I'd stab you. I told you a long time ago, Tony. Not to fuck me. Fucking little cobra monkey. All right. Mm, we have the clip there. All right. And the shell. All right. Put that to the side. And we're going to bring in the crimson guard. And we're going to look at him first before we look at into articulation the light okay now the retro one is going to come with a silver face but this black face is so nice i mean i have to oh it has the the, the that that emblem that's on the uh package hmm, didn't know, notice that but this toy i i when they announced the, the Crimson Guard, you know, Troop Builder, oh my God, I was so, um, I was, I was so, um, excited for this line. Look at that. He's got the Cobra emblem in front. He's got an eagle. I mean, it's, the, 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 the molding is so, it's nice on this guy. All right, let's look at the side here. The helmet. Like I said, they, they're going to release uh, another one, Walmart retro card hopefully they'll do the same for um Serpentor and um and dr mindbender i know what you're saying toy red what the fuck are you waiting for why don't you go ahead and post and get it remember it's the sale like look man it's inflation you asshole all right you've got the belt with the gun holder this joint's kind of loose Butterfly joints? Butterfly joints on this bad boy? I think so. Got the little thing on the side here. So regal. So cobra <laughs> Look at this knee pad. Look at the boots. Look at this, y'all. Look at that. Look at this. Look at that. I mean, you just I mean you just have to say, you know, with all the price points and all the garbage. Oh, what's this? This a little scuff. I don't know. Look like a little scuff on it. Well, look like when maybe he's fighting G.I. Joe and got clunked in the back of the head, you know. 
damn that. Coming out with mutt. <laughs> Junkyard. I don't know if I, I'm going to get that. What y'all think about the price points, man? Leave y'all the comments below, man. All right, let's get into articulation. His head can go right, left, all around. He can look up that far. I mean, because the, the, the back of that, 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 uh, that neck is hindering it, but that's how far as it'll go up. Not that far. You look that much down. Maybe you can focus on down. All right. Let's see. Head tilt a little bit. I love the face. Look at that shit. Oh, my God. I can't wait to get that fucking scrap iron. Oh, he's on my mind. All right. Arms can go out to there. He's got this cut. Whatever you call this, shoulder, this what a shoulder cut. Nice. Of course, you got the. <laughs> you've got this. You've got the shoulder, and look at it. It don't look all weird. It got that nice piece. It don't hang out. I'm, I, I'm, I don't like the uh, when 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 it's you know. Double. Double hinge elbows. You got this at the wrist. Can't really is hindered because. This glove is kind of thick, but I like it nice and tight. I, I hate my figures loose. I hate it. Same thing on this one. Yeah, I hate my figures loose, bro. And right inside there, you've got the ab crunch. Look at that. You can sit in, sit in this, his tank if that's your preference. All right, go that far. And he got waist articulation. The belt doesn't hinder that. So great. I mean, oh my God, this figure is so nice. He can do, this is hindering this leg, but he can do the splits. What you think about that, G.I. Gel? Bam. I, should, I wanted to show y'all this. When y'all doing the split, look. <laughs> Double hinging, I guess. And then you just have to push it up. Push the leg up and then back into position. Damn, you got it. One gold, one, one um, gun hold here. And it's nice mold too. Look at that. What's that V for? Victory? Venom? Whatever. Wrong franchise again. Yo, I'm saying, if Hasbro can make this, they can make masks. This is what's reminding me of masks. Remember? Mar Marvel. Oh, my God. Mobile Armored Strike Command. Matt Tracker, but this is G.I. Joe, but I like I like that show, but I digress. No, fuck that. Tracker's going to lead the mission. Spectrum's got such supervision. My mama mast G.I. Joe. Yeah. All right. Let's see the articulation in the knees. Double hinge knees. You can almost kick his butt. I like these boots. Yeah, with the knee pads in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a boot cut. Look at that in the side. I didn't notice that. Holy shit. And you've got ankle, ankle. Yup, you've got that pivot. <clears throat> I don't want to do it too. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, man. Oh my God. Hut one, hut two. I mean, God. All right. So let's see how the guns fit in his hand. <laughs> Next on the show. Bam. Bam. All right. We are back. And look at this beauty. Oh, my God. Of all the troop builders, you got the bats and the alley vipers and even the um, televipers, which I like with the trouble bubble, which is getting this is happening. This is I mean, the Crimson Guard is just even on the cartoons. I mean, I just love it. And, then, um, you know, like I said, there's a sword. The sword can go on a belt, his backpack. It got a little hole here. You can put the sword here. Because it's kind of hindering his arm, so you could put it, see, see that? 
put it right here. Plug that in. Bam. And he's ready for battle. He's ready to go into war with G.I. Joe, man. Oh, and another thing. I hope they come out with Cobra Commander with that battle armor um, suit. Remember? Operation Dragonfire. Operation Dragonfire. I was once a man. Yeah. Got a peg here. Got the knife. Put the knife. Take the knife out. So I can stab. Another G.I. Joe guy. I hope they make they make snow job, man. It might as well make um iceberg. That the black guy, I think that's his name. There's a knife. And it right in that holster. So leave your comments below and tell me which your personal favorites you want them to make that they haven't made. Because they are they they big boy. I don't know about him. Hopefully they'll make Nemesis Enforcer. The Shadow Tracker looks good. Looks like a <laughs> souped up damn uh, Ghost Rider figure. I mean, uh, all right, there I go. Cr crossing franchises again. But tell me what y'all think about this figure. Tell me this. This I I think this is definitely a definite pickup. Um, I I, I don't know if I said it before. I went inside the Target. Early in the morning, this was like three months ago, and I saw this guy. It's two of them, and then one guy came into the toy lot like he's fucking um, Terminator and shit. And I scooped this up. I told y'all I scooped him, say Serana, and uh, Dusty up quick, cause this motherfucker looks like he turned out to be a good guy. But you know, you never know with some of these guys. They, these, these people, your fellow. Hunters, some are greedy, some are picking up six and seven, eight fucking guys all at once, and it's, and, it's, and, it's, and it's getting on my damn nerves. All they need is one. You know what I'm saying? So, But I digress. So leave your comments below. Tell me if there's a pickup. I know it's a pickup. Everybody's gunning for this guy. I mean, and, and don't buy scalper. Don't support scalpers. You know what I'm saying? If you can get this guy... Um, at a at a affordable price point, do so. Do not pay scalpers. Do not. They're the enemy of the um, toy collector. They're the enemy of the toy renter. And like I said, if I see one of them motherfuckers fix swapping, I'll smack the shit out of them. Smack the unholy shit. Out of those motherfuckers, because they're not extreme. You know what I'm saying? All right. So that's the end of the review. This guy has articulation. That's good. Presentation is good. So we're going to rate this guy when we come back for the final thought. All right. We're back. And I want to thank again everybody for tuning in to his review. <clears throat> and to take it away is our own Baroness. Hello, kitties. How do you like the review, huh? <laughs> Toy Rinder, give these people what they want. <laughs> you cute fucking bastard. All right. I give this figure, <clears throat> all in all, I give it an A+. Plus. <laughs> so... I, 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 out of out of the three characters, this is my favorite. I have to say, so there you have it. Um, another toy hunt is coming. Um, I have to say, I have to admit, I have to give the dog his due. I have to give the hound its bone. Uh, this Hasbro GI Joe classified live stream was a success. Um, even. Uh, home girl, the light skinned girl, the lady, uh, Miss Fatty, even though even she was a little cutie. If I wasn't married, I'd probably bend her over and, and do her like, like mutt and junkyard. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, be, I'm being inappropriate. Anyway, but but that's how it is. I, I'm extreme, motherfucker. Anyway, uh, leave your comments below and tell me what y'all think about the, the, the um, G.I. Joe 
classified uh, uh, live stream with your favorites, what you want them to make. Uh, I just keep on being extreme and bringing out these reviews. I'm expanding the channel now, doing more reviews. And it's gonna, it's just gonna get more extreme. But I digress. Thank you for coming, you know, coming into my review. We're reviewing number fifty in the class of our line, and yes, it comes with a um, open case. I should have said that earlier. Uh, as you know, Hasbro's not gonna be doing this. These are probably the last uh, figures in the series that's gonna have open window like this all as you've seen uh like flint and uh cover girl and um the um the um the, the original outback they're gonna be closed what y'all think about i'm getting that gun hole with the red shirt nice nice the bazooka oh my god um, hopefully could they come out with, uh, Ninja Force. I would like a, a Banzai figure. Them ninjas was dope. So, with that being said, thank you for tuning in. Be on the lookout for more reviews. <clears throat> Some more coming down the pike. So, with that being said, this has been a presentation of Extreme TV. Crimson Guard, G.I. Joe Classified Review. And we'll all see you in the toy aisles. <laughs> Cobra! Crimson <laughs> God, I love this guy. <laughs>